It's oh, hi, I'm hi. Sis Hoffman, and this is Mom. Hi, I'm Mommy Hoffman, and it's Labor Day 2010. Happy Labor Day. I can't say I've been in labor for quite some time or done any hard labor for, well, I just made lunch for a bunch of girls. We're going to do the Fox DVDs and ABC order. Fox DVDs. Okay, we got some order. new ones, so this is very exciting here at Casa de Hoffman. First one I have is Alvin the Chipmunks. This is the 2007 DVD I got in 2007. For an awful long time, I think. In the movie, um, it just came out. <laughs> yeah. In the movie, they um, they got to write a song and they, in, yeah, you know, faster. They got to write a song and cute, cute, cute movie. Very cute, very cute. Okay, you know what? That's gonna be a problem. Okie dokie, moving right along. Oh, we're taking them from the bottom? Alvin the Chipmunks, the Squeakquel. This is the 2009 DVD. In the, in the sequel, Dave goes to the hospital and they have to stay with um, Toby. And oh boy, Toby is not the best choice of babysitters, is he? Yeah. It's cute though because the three little girls, Brittany yeah. and what's her names? Jeanette and Eleanor. And Jeanette and Eleanor are join the, join the mix. Here, let's show that cute little close up of the. Oh God! I'm it's angry. pretty funny, but the movie itself is just a little sad in some parts, but it's still funny. Okay, why are we taking from the bottom? Why, why, why? Yeah, girl, starring in Avatar. Here's Avatar. I saw this at my school the other day, and I saw it. it's really cool movie. To James Carbon, who was in Snow Dogs. Do you know that? Yeah, and I, you know, I watched the first few minutes of this yesterday because I don't know. We got busy or something. Anyway. Avatar is like a cool film, I think. I'm sure it's very good. But Lewis really wants me to watch it, so I will. I'll watch the whole thing when I have three hours with nothing to do. Here's a sad film, cheaper by the dozen one, but still sad. funny. It's hilarious. There's one little tiny, tiny, tiny thing, which what happened? The frog dies. The frog dies. Big it's a sad film. film. Frogs die, you know. But still a funny movie, but still a sad film. It's hilarious. It's the cutest thing ever. Here's Better than to watch the movie, watch the commentary. At the end, where the director talks to all the kids and talks about making it. That's the best part. And Sean Levy directed this film. We love Sean Levy. Are we really going from the bottom there? Yeah, we're just going in ABC order. Just be quiet. Well, what, here's the sequel, Cheaper by Dozen 2. Out the, the corner. Did you learn that in high school? Yeah. Here's the sequel, Cheaper, cheer sequel, cheaper by Dozen 2. This is the sequel to the first film. Very cute. Very cute. Funny. Right? Funny as heck. We were talking about that at lunch just now at Uncle Sam's Pizza, you and me, weren't we? Yeah. We had a date. We just got back. I did not eat pizza, just for the record. What did you eat? This little chicken and onion thing. Just no bun. Here's a funny film. Dr. Doolittle with Eddie Murphy. This is a funny movie. It has a Eddie Murphy and Chris Rock. He's in this film, too. So you know that's funny, right? Just Eddie Murphy, Chris Rock, funny. And yeah, John with Gazzano. And Gary Shandling's in this film, and Albert Brooks, you know, funny Albert people. Brooks. All funny people. Yes, all very, very, very funny people. Also, it's Chris Rock. Okay, come on, keep it moving. We're uh, three minutes, 27 seconds. <laughs> Everyone's Hero. This is about a baseball film. I got, we got a blockbuster when the last time we got it, right? Yeah. The last time we were there. They accuse this poor kid of stealing Babe Ruth's bat. Can you imagine? They accuse a little kid of that. He didn't do it. I don't like that. But it's still a good movie, I think. Okay. The bat talks, the ball talks. Cute. Very cute, right? Yeah. And it's a hero. Okay. Here's Garfield the movie, a 2004 <laughs> DVD. This is cute. Garfield's cute. I didn't know how cute it was. Odie, cute. Cute, 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 cute. Garfield. He's a, I like, oh, I could hang out with Garfield. He's a and, cool dude. And um, <laughs> I know John. John, um, when John um, hangs out with um, Liz, that Yeah, thing. then he had a cute, kind of neat added footnote to this movie. For those of you that are old like me, that were Party of Five fans, it was a great, great, great show on TV a few years back. The little girl, Lacey Chambert, who was the youngest daughter in the series, is in this, and she's adorable. Horn Years of Who with Jim Carrey and Steve Carell. Uh, come on. Funny men. That's funny. Because yeah. they're funny men, right? It's just cute. You know what? It's Dr. Seuss. Say no more. Anything by Dr. Seuss is cute and funny, right? This is Digital Cop Sign. This is the movie. Also have Seth Rogen and um and um who else is in this? Voices, just voices, just. Oh, um, let me see here. Will Arnett's in it. Who? Will Arnett. Oh, Will Arnett. Will. I 
Ice Age one. This is a really good movie, but it's a little sad in the middle. Oh, well, it's just because you know. like a they almost got thrown in the fire. Remember? I so seriously have never seen the end of this movie because we watched part way and then he leaves, and I've never seen the end. Here's Negus didn't watch it. Here's Lewis will sit and watch it to the end by himself. I will not. Here's the sequel, Ice Age: The Meltdown. This is another good sequel. That's what we just got yesterday, right? Yeah. It, yeah, it has Ellie in it. Oh, that's right. Oh, that's the one with Ellie. Ellie the mammoth? Yeah. <gasps> you know what we just bought last night? Side note, Ellie beer. Mm -hmm. Ellie, yeah. Voicing Queen with Aoife and the original cast. Ellie nut brown ale. For those of you kind of Mr. Sweet. McGorn's Wonder Emporium. This is like a creative film. Very creative. Very, very And creative. Dustin Hoffman. Great. And yeah. Dustin Hoffman. Great, we love Dustin, don't we? Uncle Dustin, from Uncle Dustin. Dustin Hoffman. Yeah, that's a really cool, cool film. Here's another cool film, Night at the Museum, with Ben Stiller, um, oh, oh, wait, um, no, almost is on this film, he's, he is. Yeah, and it also has, um, boy. yeah, and, um, Rob Williams, Rob Williams and, is Teddy Roosevelt. and, um, who else is in this, um, oh, um, Dick Van Dyke. No, oh, he is, so cute with the silver hair, very cute. No, Obi though. There's this, you see that dinosaur yeah, yeah, guy. Dinosaur, he was very cool. It was very, very amazing how they did this technology really is creative today. I gotta I gotta give it that. Here's the sequel. Night the Museum Battle the Smithsonian. Good job. This is the sequel. Sequel. Very cute sequel. Very cute. Here's the sequel. For a sequel, it was actually very, very good. And uh Hank Azaria. <laughs> Hilarious. He liked gay king for this. King, what is he? King? I'm in the middle. I don't know what he is. Very yeah. Funny. Nymph Island. I got this movie at Blockbuster. Um, we bought it at Blockbuster for fourteen dollars a night. It's almost fifteen dollars. This oh. has Abigail Breslin, Joey Foster, and Joe Butler. I've never seen it actually. I shouldn't say anything. Should I? Yeah, I haven't seen this. I again seen the beginning. <laughs> <laughs> Funny, huh? Yeah. Okay, you think it's funny. Here's a here's a funny film. That's Napoleon funny. Dynamite. That's right. That's funny. This is a funny movie. Oh, sure. Yeah. Here's this. You see the this is widescreen and the other is full screen. Here's a funny film. That was funny. That's You'll funny. laugh till it hurts wet. <laughs> <laughs> Here's another funny film. Hey, this, what am I here today? This, this is the Simpsons movie, a 2007 DVD release. And this is a funny movie. It has, um, I don't know the actors in this. But when we go to Home Depot now, what do you still call it? Dome, Dome Depot. Depot. Dome Depot from this movie, 100 years ago. We still call it Dome Depot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, I fixed the newspaper article because that's the Simpsons game in here and just some other stuff. Excellent. Keep going. Come on. Eight minutes. We are losing time here. The Sound uh, of Music. You know what was on last night on TV? Who? Uh, the Sound of Music. Yeah. Oh. This best movie ever. 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 It has a nice shiny uh, slipcase. Nice slipcase, but best movie ever. Except the one I bought, what I buy the other day. One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest. Possibly best movie ever. This one and two. Oh no. This doesn't come They're in different categories. Him. I, it's easy to put it back in this way. If anybody's watching this and hasn't seen One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest, who's over the age of mm, and 18? And Whip It. This is the 2009 DV. Whip It. This is with Ellen Page, Drew Barrymore, and, and, and eventually... Tristan Wick is funny. Yeah, and, and eventually Drew Barrymore directed this film. Yes, it was her directorial debut, I think. Drew Barrymore directed and this Ellen film. And Ellen Page from Juno, the cutest thing ever. And it's Juno. really a good coming of age. Ellie watched it. She's only 11. She watched it. It's a very, very, very powerful about, you know, own it, do it. Wow, we did good. And only nine minutes. And we need to bid everybody a very happy Labor Day. And we will see you soon in another DVD. Oh, so cute. Bye. Bye.